Uh, my stage name came about when I was with my older brother, right? Um, we were in a room and I really wanted a rap name. I had a rap name already, but it was so uncool. Um, it was Bayani. It didn't even make sense. I don't know why I called myself that. So we were looking for a name and I was so fascinated by star signs, you know, stuff like that. He put me on anyway. So yeah, man. And he was like, why don't we do something that like that like incorporates your star sign because you're so fascinated with your star sign i'm an aries so you know and then we started playing with it he started calling it air Aries, like airs and and then it didn't make sense though so i was like how about we say a Aries and then give every letter a significant term you know what i mean so a stands for above and then the r stands for reality so it's above reality exceptionally emotional conscious with everything that's what that's what like the name basically means so i think it describes me and my sound holistically so yeah above reality exceptionally emotional conscious with everything i'm from pretoria man i rep the one two cap city rap city coming here for the capital you know what it is man in a little place called westview not a lot of people know this place you know, a lot of people are familiar with Edgewoodville, Mami Lodi, Sosha. You know, I'm from Westview, man. It's a small area just before Edgewoodville, so that's what I rap, man, all day. I don't have music influences anymore. I listen to my music most of the time, so I don't have that anymore. But I listen to a lot of music. Like, I don't, I don't have a specific, I don't just listen to hip hop because I do hip hop. I listen to a lot of things, man. Even like movie scores, like I listen to that. I listen to superhero theme songs. I listen to whatever I can listen to. So yeah. I'm finally buzzing. I was 15 rapping like I was 20 or something. By 2014, I had all of your favorites frustrated, confused, and afraid of the youngest. So I was thinking about, man. I'm thinking about what I, I'm always thinking about my future endeavors, bro. You know, I'm, I feel like I'm future orientated more than anything. So. For me, the current situation, shebang, was just, it had passed already, you know what I mean? So, couldn't was just a song that was out there to say, yo, I'm still out here, man, just watch out, man. The boy got bars still, I ain't lost it, so, you know what I mean? Be cautious. But besides that, dog, I'm looking at the future, man. I'm just moving forward, nothing. I, I feel like... For me, man, it's a new experience and I feel like I'm doing exceptionally well in everything that I'm doing right now, you know what I mean? I rapped on a trap beat via the Couldn't song. I don't do trap. This shit right here makes tomorrow today. But I killed the song for sure, you know what I mean? And if I put an album out of sweat, this gonna be everywhere on the shelf. So, for me, man, there's no difficulty, challenge, pressure, no nothing, nothing like that, man. It's a new experience and I'm happy. I'm, you know what I mean? I'm learning. It's progressive, you know what I mean? Because these days I'm in the studio with more like, with more than five artists when usually I could be alone and do music alone all the time, which was, you know, really, it was restricting me. I wasn't like really creative like that because I was one dimensional, but now I could, you know what I mean? So. Yeah, man, no none of that. Pay no never mind, homie. Trust me. Me. A lot of me. And I hope they could relate. Like, my music is based on my life experiences, what happens around me, you know? And things that I think about on a daily basis. So, I'm just hoping that someone out there relates. Because that's all I got. All I got is me, man. That's all I could give you. More of me. It feels right. It feels, I feel like I deserve it. I mean, you know, 2014, I thought was my year, actually. You know, I thought 2014 was the year. Y'all, y'all, you know, y'all mess with A. Reese and his music and all that, but it wasn't. I had to be patient, so my stars won't align like that. So now, man, I feel like it's time, you know, and I'm very grateful for that. Ambitious entertainment forever, man. With my music, I hope, I, man, I hope to change lives, man. I hope to inspire people to, I hope to encourage people to always be themselves, no matter what, you know what I mean? Because it was so hard for me to be myself my time growing up, you know? I always wanted to be cool, 
I always wanted to be the, the, the center of attention and all that. So I just want to encourage people to be themselves, man, because it's very easy. It's so effortless to be yourself. That's why my music is about me, you know. So, yeah, man. Nah, man. I ain't giving you none of that. You know, I'm just... I'm going to just tell you, though, that I'm like six tracks in. Like six tracks that are like radio friendly, that are like singles. You know what I mean? Those songs for for the public fairly, you know what I mean? But I'm working on my album, man, and it's gonna be great. And I'm taking my time with it. I'm not rushing anything, you know, because, hey, it's gotta be, it's gotta be about me, man.